Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, well, whenever it resonates, but, you know, it was right around the 10th, could be the 11th, 12th, any, any time, okay, because the timing is fluid. Um, I have to mention that not, not every reading is for you, <laughs> you know, I, I get comments, well, I got a comment yesterday, somebody said something stupid. Not every reading is for you. And it's like, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. Is it, well, you don't, huh? Do you really honestly think that every reading that you watch is for you? Take what resonates and leave the rest. Three of wands. Get prepared. Get prepared for an arrival. Something is coming that you asked for. This is going to give you the opportunity to leave something behind. I think the decision has been made. I think you've been waiting for this arrival. You may have been waiting. You may have been praying. Here it is. This is what you've been praying for. It's almost like the universe sees that you have made your decision. They see that that you don't want to be where you've been and now you now your ship is coming in. You've been waiting for it. Here it is. Now you think about ship, it could be relationship, whatever it is. Here it is. It's right there. It's an exciting opportunity, too. It's right there. It's right, right, right there. Pretty soon it will be right in front of your face. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Hierophant reversed. Somebody may be moving. Okay? And I know I say this a lot. But this could be like uh, going someplace. This is the a change in your establishment. A change at home. Okay? Um... There could have been some short-lived success, a short-lived commitment, a short-lived um, marriage, something that was short-lived. Um, this is a, this is losing it all, perhaps. This is a, um, if may, somebody may have been doing something illegally. Okay, they may have been doing something illegally and. Now there's going to be a huge loss. We have somebody that has a hard time doing the right thing because of social pressure. I mean, this is like a father figure. Or being controlled by a father figure that is questioning his authority. This person is very much uh, all about social pressure in the reversed. Um, can't do the right thing. Has made some poor business decisions. Okay. And we have a relationship that is no longer on the same page. It could be a working relationship or it could be a uh, home environment. Whatever it is, there is somebody that isn't working well with others, apparently. Something is happening where there's, uh, it feels like there's going to be a split. Somebody may be leaving. And I think I, think I said moving. They may be leaving. They're right. They made their decision. I'm leaving. Now somebody is coming to get them. They're, they're, they're you know, getting on board. They're moving. Um, ready to focus on the future and leave the past behind, leave this uh, disaster behind. It looks like it's a disaster. So it does. It does. I mean, the Ten of Pentacles reverse is complete ruin. It is unstable. It's an unstable business or an unstable home life or both. And they could be fighting over money, which makes somebody decide that it's time to go. Okay, so I think that we have a very controlling individual here with that hero font reverse that is very much driven by society and driven by money that probably has abused his power and has pushed somebody away, has caused this person to, uh, the decision is made, okay, with, with that three of wands, because the two of wands is the moment of decision, okay, so the decision is made, this person is just waiting, they're just waiting for their, for, for their ride, right, they're waiting for their 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 rescue okay so i think that um, whoever is coming to get them is really 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 close they're really close to um being rescued put it that way um night of there's been some sort of abuse 
Knight of Swords reversed. There could have been in some sort of explosive um, outburst. There could have been a massive fight. There could have been what well, something is. Whether it's going to happen, this could absolutely happen because you know these are these are previews, right? We have a know-it-all here. We have a know-it-all that blames everybody, doesn't want to take accountability. This person is insincere. They are a bully. They are explosive, and they are dangerous. We have somebody here that may have some mental health problems that is, has probably led somebody into a dangerous situation. They probably do things illegally. You know, maybe they um, sell drugs, something like that. You know, they do. They, there's definitely illegal dealings here. So somebody, you know, could end up getting caught. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Now the Seven of Pentacles reversed is, uh, there's no growth. This is a dead end. Dissatisfied, very unrealistic that something didn't grow. It didn't, it wasn't, whoever's, Somebody was dealing with an individual that was so focused on their money that there's no way a relationship could grow. Okay? Um, this person was very much focused on money, 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 and what society had to say. And they were abusive. They were abusive. They had, it wasn't about feelings. It, it wasn't. It was about money. It was about what society had to say. And this person that was very driven by society, um, now it's like their business isn't growing. Or their relationship isn't growing. And it's because they were um, selfish. They were selfish. You know, if you think about the higher power, which is God, God doesn't like that. Yeah, they may, the, the devil may give you gratification for a little while. But God will, you know, rectify that. So, anyway. Um, Here we go. We got a loss of power. We got somebody here that is losing. They're losing their power. They're losing their... It feels like they're losing their, their financial stability. Um, they acted in an ignorant manner. They were they were bullish. They were um, abusive. They, we have a master manipulator here that is very skilled at... Uh, um, communication this person knows how to communicate this person and uh, communicate in a material in a manipulative way this person is a pathological liar um smooth 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 talker um the lies roll this is a pathological liar they roll right this person believes their own lies that's how much of a liar we have we are a very cunning clever tricky individual who has everybody duped or they had everybody duped they did It feels as though we have somebody here that that their resources are dr are dwindling. You know what I mean? They've lost their resources. They're feeling powerless. Their power is being stripped away. There's a loss of power here, and this is a very masculine energy. So I don't know if it, it feels like it's a masculine is is losing their power. And this is a father figure, somebody that is masculine as well. We have a masculine energy here that is losing their resources. They're losing money and they're losing it fast. It feels like it's happening very, very fast. They're losing business. There's, they're, and, they, and it's like their resources are dwindling. Seriously, this stuff is it's like money is slipping away. It's, and they're not making money. It's, it's going south. Okay. It's, this shit is going south. Okay. Um, it's funny because typically on the magician card we have the infinity sign it's about character it's about character on this card so somebody's character um we know what goes around comes around right with the infinity sign so they have a bad if you have a bad character you know you're gonna pay for that so for lack of a better word you're really oh, let me just fix this up pay for it you are really gonna pay for it somebody's bad character um, or lack of character or lack of care is going to, uh, cause them to pay a, a pretty price and it's going to hurt their, their wallet, their, their checkbook, their, their bank account, their bank account, their resources are dwindling and they're dwindling very, 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 very fast. 
Um, this person is very much um, driven by society, and uh, they do, they really can't do the right thing. It, it to them the only right thing involves their bank account, and that's not what the higher power wants. Honestly, the higher power doesn't want you to be rich. That's the truth. Okay, that I hate to say it, but it's the truth. Okay. Um, and selfish and greedy. So anyway, um, so I think whoever this person is that is a liar, that is manipulative, that is doing things that are against the law, because I feel like this is a law breaker. This is somebody who is breaking the law. They're doing things that are against the law. This, this law breaker, I feel like this law breaker is going to get stopped in their tracks. You know, I do. This is a message that somebody doesn't want to hear. Now, this is being spied on, being investigated. Somebody may be being investigated. There could be some upcoming legalities here. Somebody could receive a message or some information that they don't want to hear. There could be some investigation that has been going on. Oh my God, there absolutely could be, because this is definitely an investigator. This is an investigator. Somebody has been watching. Somebody has been watching this person, um, watching their business or watching what they're doing. They're being watched. Somebody is definitely being watched. There's a lot of lies and there's a lot of uh, tricky behavior here. The magician reverse is somebody who is very, very cunning, skilled at hiding things. Really skilled at hiding things. It feels like we have this person that takes action without thinking. They don't even think. They just do it. They just do it. They just, you know, they take action. They don't think. And they're getting themselves. Somebody's getting, they're going to get in trouble. Somebody's going to get in trouble with law. It's like, I, I can do whatever I want. I'm never going to get caught. Ha! Yeah, you are. Delusional. We have somebody here that's delusional, and they could get violent. I mean, okay, there could be so, there could be some violence here. Okay, just gotta be honest with you. The magician reversed, the knight of swords reversed, the, the page of swords, even the king of swords. I mean, there could be some violence that comes out over money. This is a fight of over money. Somebody could get really upset because their bank account is dwindling, or their revenue is going down, or something is happening, and they lose it. They lose it. Seriously. This is out of control. A runaway train. Dangerous situation. The Knight of Swords reverse. It's dangerous. This person can't think. And he can't think because he is so upset. He is so upset over the money. So I feel like there could be... Um, you know, and perhaps because his money, his money is... Uh, such a problem. He's pushing somebody away. Because somebody's obviously leaving. They're leaving. There is a golden opportunity. There's another opportunity waiting. There's an opportunity for success. But the magician is about letting go of the old to bring in the new. And we have the magician in the reversed right here. So we are having somebody that is holding on to something that isn't stable, isn't secure, isn't even real. It's based on social pressure. And this is, it feels like the universe is saying you got to let that go. We got something real for you. A real big opportunity. This is a real opportunity that hasn't been presented to you yet. So I feel like we have somebody here that is very curious. They are very curious. They see an opportunity someplace else, which is interesting. 
This guy knows what he wants and he's going to go for it. This guy makes a decision and he goes for it. He's done his investigation and he goes for it. So I feel like there's somebody that has been watching. They've been watching another person. They have. They've done their investigation and they see this golden opportunity to swoop in. So this could go many different ways. This could be somebody with a badge, even. I mean, I'm just, I, gotta, I just happened, when I looked at that just now, I just saw a badge. So I'm not sure if it is, but for somebody, if you are doing stuff illegal against the law and you have a business, you know, you could certainly have a private investigator or somebody that's been, been investigating you show up at your door unannounced and, you know, whatever, it doesn't look good. If you, um,. I think if you are, say you're a single woman, it's a single woman, say you're a single woman, we could go all day with these cards, say you're a single woman, you got somebody who's curious, you got somebody who's interested in you, they've been watching you, they're interested, they're coming, they're close, they're really, really close, if you are that single woman that has been waiting there, they see you as a golden opportunity and they've made up their mind, the decision has been made and they should be there soon, okay? They're right in front of you. Pretty soon you'll be face to face with this person. If you are in a uh, commitment with somebody that is abusive, because this is a bully, this is abusive, this is somebody who's only focused on their money. That's all they're focused on. They're not focused on love in any way, shape, or form, because there is no love in these cards. This person is very social, socially you know, um, centered, so centered on their money and what it looks, what they look like to society. We have a pathological liar here who, uh, can sell anything, even if it's broken and it came from, uh, China. <laughs> anyway, you know, this person can sell anything. That's how much, how smooth they are. This smooth talker, um, is going to experience a loss. So if you are in the relationship with this, I think there's a relationship that is not on the same page. Uh, somebody has been thinking about leaving. It's a dead end. It's very unrealistic. It's sad. There's no more growth here. They've been fearful. They've been fearful because this guy is probably violent. This guy is probably violent. So they've been fearful of leaving because they know this guy is violent. He may have a history of violence. But I think they're going to leave anyway. They've been probably, probably planning it. Probably planning this. So there's a few different stories here. Um, there is. There is a new opportunity, a golden opportunity waiting for you to grab onto it. Somebody sees it and they're going to grab onto this golden opportunity. This is an opportunity for something stable, solid, secure, long term. But you have to be willing to shed the old to bring in the new because that is the meaning of this card. Somebody um, has made a, a very poor decision to focus on um, money more than a relationship or more than anything else. And I feel like this person that has done that is going to experience complete ruin. Because that is the Ten of Pentacles reversed. Good luck.